Sibley is one of several large textile mills that were built in the Augusta area after the Civil War. So Sibley uh, was a raw cotton in, finished product out mill for many, many years and the last stuff that it made was denim fabric. Describing the architecture of these mills, I've heard people call it industrial gothic. Um, it, it's kind of a hodgepodge, but the Sibley is particularly pretty. In fact, when it was built, they made it a little fancy to kind of say, hey, we're back. Hello, capitalists. Here's what you can expect when you come down south. This is actually on the site of the Confederate Powder Works. When the, the Powder Works was torn down, uh, Colonel Raines, who had built it, was still here. He was a professor at the Medical College of Georgia and uh, very active in the Confederate Survivors Association. And he thought that the chimney should be maintained as a war memorial. So it's actually officially dedicated as a memorial to the Confederate dead. Hydropower has really kind of been the lifeline that's kept it alive. Uh, we have uh, big generators over on the west side of the building and there's a staff there that still maintains them 24 hours a day. Augusta Canal has been providing power since it was built in the 1840s and it's the only industrial power canal in the United States that's been in continuous operation. Really uh, pretty remarkable that we have it right here. The canal itself, everybody loves because it's become a major park. Um, you can hike, you can bike, you can walk. The old towpath that used to pull, the mules would pull the boats up with the cotton on them. Sibley is beautiful from the outside, but you can't come inside and see what's going on in here. Uh, but there are places that you can visit and learn a lot about the textile industry and the mill culture and the canal. And one of those places is the Discovery Center. Uh, that's located inside another textile mill called the Enterprise. So if you're coming to Augusta and you want to get a little flavor of what, what the um, cotton mill life was like, that's a great place to start.